Whoa! Calm down, boy. Calm down there. I know you're excited that we're playing Fallout 3 again. Doesn't mean you have to start barking like crazy. Alright, everyone. Well, welcome back to Fallout 3. Uh, it's actually been a while since I played the game. I think it's been over a week. Uh, and uh, therefore, I said, let's jump back in every once in a while. I enjoy doing that. What we're going to do today is we are going to be playing the Pit DLC. Or at least we're going to attempt to be playing the Pit DLC. Okay? Looks like if I go to Oasis, that's my best bet for getting there. So let's head to Oasis. Um, you know, as of right now, I've only been doing story-related content with a few side missions. And uh, I've been trying to also get all the achievements that I missed during my first playthrough of the game. I, I played the Pit DLC... Uh, during my first playthrough of the game. Well, however, it was... Remember, the DLCs came out after I'd beaten the game. And so, quite honestly, it's going to be refreshing to be doing these during the course of the game and see how they tie in with stuff, okay? Let's see if I can reduce my weight at all, because I'm already at 260, which is bad. Son of a bitch, I have so many items. There we go. Reduce my weight a little bit. And I should probably... I have no blood packs, damn it. Use some stim packs here. Kill myself. Alright, so. The pit it is. We're gonna head to the pit. We're gonna see how we do. What the fuck? Put this away. What do you mean I'm hidden? I'm not crouch. I was crouching? I didn't mean to be. Oops. Alright, we got. Charon, we've got dog meat. you've got a squad now, which I never really had during my first playthrough of the game. If you remember, I uh, I did have a follower, but a Biff, but he died so fucking quickly that really, uh, besides that, I only had like one or two followers. I don't believe I had Charon during my first playthrough. I think I went back and got him later. So this is going to be pretty cool. Of course, remember that the followers can't usually follow you into a DLC. In fact, I don't think they can come, so they're going to be waiting for me. People are telling me to go to my house and store items. Alright. I'll do that then. I'll store my stuff. Where the fuck am I? We'll travel to Megaton and store the stuff because they apparently take all your stuff in the pit. Yeah, that's true. I remember now. You can't use any of your items. You have to start over, basically. Yes? Yes? What the fuck are you? Oh my god, look at her hair! Ugh! A shaven head with two fucking little ponytails. What the fuck? These people are weird, man. <laughs> Alright. Can we leave our followers here? First of all, do I have any bobbleheads? I do! Haha. -ha. So we got five bobbleheads. Once we hit ten, we get the achievement. Okay. Can I tell him to stay here? Stay here, boy. Don't move till I come back. So he's gonna stay at the house. Yes, what is it? Get a haircut. Wait here. I shall wait here until you return for me. Alright, that works. I might as well sleep so I'm well rested. And then I'll store my items. Alrighty. Uh, where do I store this? In a locker, right? Any of these lockers I can store this shit? It's like infinite storage capacity? The rounds don't fucking weigh anything, so those I can leave. Here, I'll put all the bottle cap mines. The birch sap. Plasma rifle. Alright, cigarettes. Well, buttons, wig, all this, all this shit. Coffee mug. I didn't even know I had a coffee mug. Ammo doesn't weigh anything. <laughs> Eulogy shows his hat. That's pretty funny. I 
I should just empty my my inventory, shouldn't I? The ammo too, because they're gonna take my ammo. There we go. Whoa, shit! I went too far. I kept mashing. There's still stuff in there. There we go. So I'm naked. <laughs> He's in black tidy whiteies. They're not white, they're black. Tidy blackies. People are like, you get your stuff back. I know you do, but if you remember when I first played the pit, I don't think I knew how, and I think I lost all my shit. I don't think I ever got it back. I couldn't figure out where to go to get my shit back. Look at him, he looks stupid as hell. Where am I right now? I don't even know. Hope! 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 <laughs> oh my god, people are right saying you fight your way into the pit. Ah, oh, I remember now. Remember the pit was the glitch DLC where nothing loaded at the beginning? God damn it, I gotta take all my shit again. Actually, no, I'm just gonna grab one or two things. I'll grab one or two things. Alright, so let's grab... We'll make it simple. We'll take the plasma rifle. We'll take my armor. Take the is it? I don't remember which one of these it is. We'll take both, just in case. It's one of those three. We'll take a few stim. We'll take the stim packs. I'll get those back. We'll take the the helmet. So the most bare bones I could possibly be here. How the fuck do I still have the repellent stick? You can't drop that? Wow. Uh, there we go. This is all I need. This gun's so fucking overpowered, I'm gonna rape everything that I fight, so... It's not a big deal, I'm not gonna be dying or anything. So, that was a complete waste of time to do all that, but at least this way, if it does bug out, if the game does bug out and I, or I forget and I can't get my shit back, the worst of it is that I'll lose the, this rifle, which is fine because this rifle's overpowered too. It's daytime now, too, which is a plus. You can actually fucking see. Uh, alright. Back to Oasis. <clears throat> alright. To the pit. Shoot her in the face. The great one. <clears throat> You're an idiot. Worshipping a fucking a guy from Fallout 2 who's stuck in fucking a, a living uh, a tree that fucking infested him. Soldier! I fucking fell off the bridge and an Octave Soldier attacked me. What the fuck?
Can't wear this armor right now. Son of a bitch. Well, that sucked ass, and I'm stuck down here. Fuck. Alright, well, we're still on the right track. <clears throat> Just a little road bump. 